doing all this stuff with the trades like you're saying, why is there such a big difference between China and America as far as trade goes? Oh, great. Point. I mean, we're getting stumped, and I mean really stumped, I mean, and it's not just so so since you, but this China's has gone on for 50 years, China. and no one, let me no one is doing anything about it. It's because we, we don't have a, a trade agreement with China. No. We well, don't have a trade what, agreement with China. Then, uh, maybe and so maybe what, what we would love, what I would love to see, because China is the bigger, the biggest aggressor uh, and far, violator by far. of trade standards, in my opinion. So when it comes to things like currency manipulation, all these 150 points, these things like intellectual property theft, right. rule of law based trade, uh, China to me is the target. Yeah. They're not in these negotiations with the Trans-Pacific Partnership or with the European Union. Would I love to see China sitting across the table going, hey, you know what, no more of this. This is not acceptable. You are no longer an emerging market as they are in the World yeah. Trade Organization. I've been listening to several speeches and by And what we need to do is hold them accountable. That's the real target at the end of the day, in my opinion. Several speeches by Donald Trump on, on how far their shaft, and excuse my French, Mr. United States this is a and very other countries. an interesting and important issue. But the fact of the matter is that most of us have come here because of the issue of gas development and gas storage.